You it is good yo it's your boy time back here with another video and in this video today we are going to be doing a gameplay of the new pink diamond john havlicek you know anything about my team about last year this time we saw the opal john havlicek is this john havlicek anything like him well maybe on one end of the court before we dive any further into that if you are new to the channel and have not yet make sure to smash that subscribe button 65 203 pounds 91 3 by 75 driving neck 86 ball handle 80 block 95 still 91 perimeter 82 interior 89 speed 85 speed ball, 89 acceleration as well as that 94 lateral quickness tendency wise not great for hondo badge wise is great though 10 off aimers catch and shoot difficult shots clamp styles fender stop and pop volume shooter fast twitch menace and huster 40 on gold corner specialist blue hands diamond pickpocket pick dodger interceptor intimidator off ball pest post lockdown blinder circus threes limitless desk on handles for days quick first step dead eye green machine hot zone hunter all the badges you could ask for now it is gonna have five badge spots what do you guys think you should give him probably chef then maybe quick chain rim protector chase artist ankle breaker brick wall those are some of the main badges that i see looking at hondo here on next gen the first thing y'all gotta realize is dribble stop is fine i mean he, he's gonna move decently and honestly release wise guys it's not what it was last year but his release is smooth i'm not gonna sit here and hate on it a release that i think is super duper smooth in my team and a release that i think you should be able to green with very consistently that's just my opinion you guys don't have to agree with me but you should not miss very many shots with hondo hot spots from literally everywhere on the court you guys can see how cheesy this drifter can be obviously if you don't shoot it early if you do time it right i mean drifter wise very very solid as well so release wise i don't hate it for john havlicek i really don't especially the drifter going to the right it's definitely a tough thing to guard against and i mean i've made basically 75 green 75 percent of those which is really tough behind the back not great tween not ideal but release wise is very solid and movement wise for havlicek i mean quite honestly guys is not bad looking at hondo here on current gen where he was literally the best last year we can't forget how good that john havlicek is especially if you knew how to dribble and how to use base 98 I wasn't the biggest fan of him. I actually never locked in the guard. Even, I mean, everybody had him for 250. I didn't play with the guard. I was still running the Tracy McGrady uh, as well as, uh, who was my backup shooting guard? Terry Dishinger, guys like that. But basically, everybody else loved this John Havlicek. And rightfully so. Like, this card definitely was a hooper in my team. I don't think anybody is going to disagree with that uh, the statement right there. And, I mean, if you look at the card movement-wise, again, dribbling, not great. But his release is solid. Movement in the half court is solid. Drifter wise, at least on next gen, is solid. Current gen, obviously, it's a little different because you can't really cheese with it. But it's still easy enough to time, easy enough to green. I have a feeling that John Havlicek in 2K is going to be pretty underrated because of because just the expectations he has to live up to. John Havlicek looked pretty solid in shoot around right there. I'm excited to use him at the Pink Diamonds here. We're 40 and 0. One win away. But man, I'm nervous to use him. It looks like my opponent here does have a decent enough squad. I mean, really does. John Wall, Clay, I see uh, Kawhi, AK. Like, he's got them guys. He doesn't have Hondo, though. Uh-oh. Who wants a Krabby Patty at 3 in the morning? Oh, boy, 3 a.m. <laughs> oh, yeah, Hondo. Go get yourself one, baby. I'm cool with giving that one up. Oh yeah, Hondo, straight to the cup. I see you, baby. Come on, man. It's not even like it's a one-time thing. It is constantly getting bailed. Thank you, AK. Up to Yaya. Back to AK. Yeah, my opponent on that. My opponent not bad. He not terrible. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, chill. He yeah, X-switched that. Good for him. Good for him, X-Switching, man. Good for him. Because I got John Havlicek, who is still making things happen. Uh-oh. 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 I'll take the assist for Hondo. You want to commit that much attention? Cool. That's cool with me, man. That is so cool with me. KP, please give me a paint stop, baby. 
Please give me a... That's a stop right there. KP's bored. Thank you, Ron. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I don't necessarily like how this possession is going so far. Do I not have Chef on him? I don't think I do right now. AK. Imagine them leaving AK-47 wide open. Just not a very wise idea right there. 34%. Okay, Hondo, you got six and two. Say what you want. Hondo not playing terrible. Free, right? Thank you. LaMelo time. Uh-oh. No rotation either? You're letting LaMelo Ball get that easy of a look? Come on, Hondo. Straight to the rim. Good patience with it. Good patience with it, Hondo. Great patience with it. And D-Rob left KP, which is just not a wise idea. If you leave KP, man, you're brave. That's all I'm going to say. He missed that. That's bad that he missed that because that was wide open. Literally wide open. Hondo work. Nope. I got a full. I know you're tired, but giving me a full right there is crazy. First half is about 10. I want to get Hondo just another look, man. Just give him another look. There you go, Hondo. Coming off a of screen. Giannis set a big body right there. Credit to him. But Hondo knocked that thing down. Good, LaMelo. You're good. Yes, sir. We're good. Run. Where, where my man Hondo at? I just got to let that thing fly. That's really me. It's really me. Into Giannis, I'll take the two points no matter what. I should have let that drifter with John Havlicek just fly. You look at his after and box score, nine points, four assists. He's played okay in that first half. Oh, yeah, Giannis, we're sitting in the lane. Come on, run. We're Hondo. We're Hondo. I had to let it fly. I had to let it fly. And I'm getting 2K21 vibes from this Hondo, man. Realistically speaking, guys, right after doing this game, I'm going to sell John Havlicek. I do not think he is, you know, a top five or so shooting guard in my team. And a lot of that is just living up to the hype of last year. It's not better than Kawhi, not better than Reggie, not better than Terry, not better than Kobe, not better than a lot of guys we have currently in the game. But he is, you know, a fun card to use in my team. That's kind of the way I would describe him. Definitely not a card worth picking up as I'm going to go back and sell him right now. But if you did like John Havlicek last year, I mean, I can't really say to pick him up because they're completely different cards. But let's say if you were a big Boston Celtics fan and really do want John Havlicek, he can compete on the court. The card's not terrible by any means. He's just not a card you look at or you run and it's like, okay, this card is, you know, one of the best cards in the game. Just not really what you're going to get out of John Havlicek. Hoping he mine can sell for 55,000 MT, and I, I just take that MT and run. I'm glad I got the game plan. I'm glad I got the win with him, but definitely not a card I would recommend in NBA 2K22 buy team for his price. It's going to wrap it up for my video today, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy it. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new. And as always, man, I love you guys. Have a blessed day.